Sign off video like this. Check my phone. You see that time correctly. Uh, 3.53 a.m. right early in the morning. Just woke up um, and about to go work out with my buddy. I've been implementing this new schedule where we wake up early in the morning, uh, go do some calisthenics work. We're roughly doing around 125 to 150 pull-ups early in the morning. Then uh, wake up, go on about my day. And then usually I'm hitting two workouts a day. So after that, uh, do my business, uh, work, and then go, get ready for my, uh, my own job. After that, that's where I'm headed to the gym after that, hitting uh, two workouts a day. And then, yeah, the schedule's been working out for me, and I'm going to take you along the journey. Look at that, look at that. About to walk out of here. Um, I gotta be quiet a little bit, parents still slipping, but um, yeah, it's time to go get this work. Not a lot of people out here um, waking up 3 a.m., but it is what it is. Boom, we're in the car now, transitioned. Smooth transition, seamlessly uh, quality transition, but with that being said, let me see if there's a light. No, there's not. Uh, let me see. There we go, light. Um, something that I noticed working out or waking up 4 a.m. streets are super, super quiet. That's something I really love. Um, as well as, yeah, nobody's up. So, uh, for me, I, it feels like I have a competitive edge. Not only do I feel more motivated when I'm out here at 4 a.m., like, working out, but, um, it makes me understand, too, that when I wake up at 3.45, I put in the work, I go to the gym at 4 o'clock, I get the, the things I need to do done. By the time I finish, it's 5 a.m. Most people are still in bed. Most people are not even up. Even people who work out at 5 a.m., they're barely getting warmed up. I'm already done for the day. And I can use that time, go home, and then set up my stuff I need to do for the week, get all that done. And overall, 4 a.m. is just a competitive advantage. Uh, for me, if you follow Kobe, right? Kobe talked about um, training twice a day, three times a day to make it, right? go four to six and then take a break go 10 to like 12 take a break go to like four to six again take a break and then boom you're done for the day three workouts a day so having that mentality of discipline but also understanding too that if i need to if i want to outwork everybody i have to do stuff that is completely out of the normal right uh, most people think i'm crazy waking up this early i think i'm just um super motivated and super energetic and for me, um, I have a partner that's willing to wake up at the same time as me to go work out. Um, then you're gonna see him here in the video. But uh, then by all means, right? If I have somebody that's willing to work out and wake up and go through the same experience as me, then I'm, I'm down because um, before I got started here doing this like two weeks ago, I uh, made a bet. Basically, people were saying, hey, you bet you won't make wake up at 4 a.m. And for me, I, I drive off that competitiveness. So of course I'm gonna wake up at, at 4 a.m. Of course I'm gonna show that I can hang and that I really do this. So uh, with that being said, about to go hit this lift and then I'll, I'll take you guys along. We're here. We're here. So we're about to hit 150 something pull-ups. Let me finish your push-ups. About to get lit. Early as fuck, early in the morning. Nobody's out here, but we're out here, so I'm gonna record it, it's gonna be dope.
Just finished our workout. Uh, off the clips, they should be awesome. I'm gonna edit them in a way. We'll see how that goes first time editing. It's my boy Jace right here. Say what's up to the vlog, Jace. What's up? What's up, my boy? <laughs> Crazy. Waking up at 4 a.m. We've been doing that for what, like two weeks? I've been doing it for two weeks. You've been doing it for a couple months. A couple months, holy shit. All right, guys, just finished that workout with my buddy. Um, so, something cool about Jace, man, is my boy is trying to be, he's going to be a Navy SEAL. So, uh, he's been waking up for a while now, early in the morning, getting that workout in. And he's working out two, three times a day. So, um, I thought if somebody is in my local area and they're, they're disciplined and they're doing crazy things like that, I want to be a part of it. Because uh, for me, um, just... Let me turn the light back on. Uh, the drive for me is I've never really met somebody that was just as competitive. So um, it's awesome meeting somebody that is able to push you to uh, higher levels, higher highs, and then uh, ultimately you're able to just bond over that as well. So great to uh, do that. And it's awesome to have somebody. So like an accountability partner. So um, if you're trying to level up, anything could be business could be life could be physical right it's always important to have a mentor as well as having like a buddy a accountability partner there who is basically could be at the same level as you could be higher than you and they're just walking you through each step of the way just taking you with them and then you are just working together so um that can be applied across the board but um right now uh, 5 25 a.m so very early morning very early start to my day i have a sales call in 30 minutes uh, i'm gonna go deal with that and then um if you can focus here yeah, I got a sales call, and then uh, more than likely, I'm gonna spend most of my time editing this video, getting it up, and then uh, yeah, might, might show uh, some more content. But um, why I like doing this, why early routine, um, ultimately just gives me more time in the day uh, to get a lot more stuff done, to be more productive. And um, for me, um, I've been sleep going to bed around 10, 11, uh, so now my body has fully adjusted to this new routine. So, um, yeah, by the time 9 to 10 hits, my body's already tired, ready for me to go to bed. Go to bed, wake up around 3.45, go straight here, and then, uh, yeah, just get the work on and then knock out the rest of my day. Um, and, yeah.